The climate crisis is one of today's biggest challenges. Rising temperatures pose a serious threat to humanity, affecting our way of life, global health and food production. To mitigate climate change, we need to find new solutions that help to prevent the rise in temperatures. And specifically, we need scalable technologies that extract CO2 from the atmosphere. The new Novo Nordisk Foundation CO2 Research Center has been established with a mission of mitigating climate change. The focus of the center is to discover and explore new technologies for reducing the amounts of CO2 in the atmosphere through carbon capture, storage and utilization. The center is the first of its kind worldwide and has been established through a grant of close to 85 million euros from the Novo Nordisk Foundation. The Novo Nordisk Foundation CO2 Research Center sets out to become a powerhouse in our struggle against the global climate crisis. Specifically, we'll try to identify scalable technologies that will help reduce the amount of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere throughout the globe. On the one hand, looking into technologies that can capture carbon, thereby reducing CO2 levels, while on the other hand, looking into whether we can convert CO2 that is otherwise harmful into, for instance, biofuels and healthy nutrients, thereby actually creating a negative CO2 emission scenario. The center is based at Aarhus University in Denmark and builds on the university's existing world-class research in the field. The center also comprises six satellite institutions in the United States, Norway, Germany, Denmark and the Netherlands and will collaborate with a wide range of industry partners and other international universities. This mission is so big that it cannot be achieved by a single discipline and therefore the center brings together the best of life sciences and the best of chemical sciences in order to develop novel scalable technologies. The fundamental research of the center will be inspired by extensive interactions with industries because the technologies that will be developed need to be rapidly implemented for the benefit of society. One thing is for sure, the global climate crisis will not go away by itself. We need to act fast and forcefully. And our ambition in doing so is to help be one of the front runners in the global combat against the CO2 emissions, working collaboratively all over the globe.